fasting requires planning to be safe and effective, especially if you're taking medications that increase the risk of having a low blood sugar or can cause dehydration. Intermittent fasting is not recommended for individuals who are having difficulties in managing their blood sugars or have problems identifying when their blood sugars are going low. Intermittent fasting is also not recommended during pregnancy. It's important to talk to your doctor or diabetes educator before you try intermittent fasting to discuss any need for medication adjustments. Speaking with a dietitian may also be helpful to ensure that your diet is meeting all your nutrient needs and goals. Because there are different types of intermittent fasting, there is not enough research to make conclusive recommendations about intermittent fasting for people living with diabetes. It's important to note that more research has focused on people living with type 2 diabetes and very little is known about how intermittent fasting will affect people living with type 1 diabetes. Some individuals living with diabetes have experienced success achieving their goals with, through intermittent fasting, but others have also found it quite challenging and it found that this approach did not work for them. Generally, the goal of intermittent fasting is to reduce overall calorie or food intake to help with weight reduction or management. For people with diabetes, this may result in better blood glucose management, particularly in the morning, and a reduction in the need for diabetes medication. There are different types of intermittent fasting. Often people will eat nothing or a very little amount of food for a specific amount of time and then eat their regular diet on alternate days. The best studied routine is the two to five, where a person fasts for two consecutive days and then eats their regular diet for another five days of the week. Time-restricted feeding is another popular strategy that includes eating only in a specific amount of time, such as in an eight-hour window, which may occur between the hours of noon and 8 p.m.